What is up gamers, I'm Marcy Styles. I'm bringing you a, another Deadpool challenge overview video and this one's a special edition because as you see on screen, X-Force has arrived in the shop as we were talking about during the Mize challenges last night. Let's get into the Deadpool stuff starting with the video for X-Force. So that introduces us to X-Force. You can go and grab them over here in the item shop. It's broken into two bundles here. 2,500 V-Bucks will get you the gear. 3,000 V-Bucks will get you all the characters. So we're looking at like 5,500 V-Bucks for both sets. You can purchase them individually. I went and got the character set first and they brought back cuddle pool and raven pool don't do what i did and get them individually because then you're going to pay for them full price if you look over here after a second this will pop up and it's been discounted down to 500 v bucks you can get both of them for 500 v bucks don't pull a dummy like i did so going on to deadpool's challenges here as you can see i've already unlocked my challenge here and gotten Deadpool's X-Force suit but if you go in here and you go to the computer like we normally do you will find out that yes indeed all the rumors about Deadpool, Deadpool flooding the basement in the, that area is indeed true but you see it doesn't stop him any he's still going to try to play his Fortnite on his computer how he's doing that completely immersed in water is beyond me but hey it's Deadpool now I love the way this is set up with everything floating around but is it me or do you feel like there should be a turd floating around in there somewhere I mean come on Deadpool turd you know it's gonna go hand in hand so anyway let's go ahead and take a look at his challenges first off we need to find Deadpool's shorts this is just like every other find his shit challenge has been very super easy in order to do that we go into here you go down to Midas and you'll find them sitting right over on that chair ottoman also, I want to go back and touch on this. Again, I said that I thought Midas was the big bad. If you look in the background there, there's a bunch of different skins that you've used in the past that he has turned to gold as well. I don't see a hero S type person doing something like that. That's just my opinion. So then you come back. And the next objective for Deadpool is you want to salute Deadpool's pants. This gives me a little throwback to the old days of Nickelodeon with the TV show, Salute Your Shorts. So, for all intents and purposes, let's go salute Deadpool's shorts. Now, I'm not actually going to go in-game because I've already done this, but let me take you over to the challenge table. If you go to Sweaty Sands... I mean, there's a there's Deadpool's pants flying from flagpoles all over the place. But if you go to Sweaty Sands and go to the biggest building to your left, at the very top peak, you'll find a set of his pants flying there. It's really easy to get to. And all you do is you get there and you press X. Once you do that, you will unlock your X4 skin variant for Deadpool. And I said yesterday that I did not know if that would count as maskless Deadpool as well. It does. So you get both of those. And uh, from what I understand, we'll be having more challenges next week. Now in the item shop, there's still the same dances and such as there was before. So I'm not going to have any stupid dances for you. I would say join us tomorrow for Maya challenges, but... I am not positive that there's going to be any added Maya challenges, uh, so until I do know that for sure, we're just going to go ahead and say I'll see you next week for the Week 10 Midas Mission Part 2 overview video. Until then, guys, enjoy your X-Force characters and your challenges for the rest of the week, and as always, I'll be seeing you.
What? 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 What?